But to be back, I'm extremely excited. You know, it's familiar ground now for us or for myself and uh, familiar with the staff in the city and to come back to beautiful Parkview Field and be with this brand new uh, group of guys, it's, uh, it's very encouraging and exciting for myself. So you've had a, a long trip during this trip. Have you been filling these guys in on, on uh, how nice the stadium is and what the fans and everything that they're going to meet here in Fort Wayne? Sure, yeah, most of them have a good idea. I think uh, not just for myself, but everybody that's played here in Fort Wayne has talked to them about it and how, uh, how nice everything is and how first class the staff is. And um, I think they're just getting, they're looking forward to getting started, getting out of uh, spring training and get the season going. So what, what's the prospects? What are these, what's this team look like? Uh, very young on the position player side, um, but probably one of the most talented groups that I've, that I've been a part of. Um, I think our average age in the infield is going to be about 18 years old. Uh, but I woke up the other day excited to get these guys together for the first time. Our, our club didn't get officially put together until about three days before spring training ended. Um, but it's a, a group of young, talented position players, some older veteran pitching, um, and it's a good blend. Um, we're excited to see what uh, the season brings this year. Uh, talk about you guys have, I believe, nine returning pitchers. How important is it to get that many returning pitchers who played here in the city can get comfortable like that? Yeah, um, anytime you can have a veteran presence like that with uh, with the team, it's huge. You know, they can kind of help the guys that haven't been here before, um, and it's the experience. Um, it's just like kind of going back to the like your second year of high school. You know, you feel a little more comfortable. You're a little more familiar with your surroundings, um, and they know what to expect. A lot of guys haven't played on a stage this big before, um, so it's nice to have those older guys to kind of show them the ropes. I'll talk a little bit about arguably one of the biggest prospects on the team this year with Fernando Tatis Jr. What is it like? What have you seen from him so far? What pros, cons? What are you expecting from him this season? Too? Um, a lot of excitement. You know, he's uh, he can do it on both sides, defensively, offensively. Uh, very young, uh, energetic. You'll see him on the field dancing and doing a bunch of stuff. You know, he likes to be out there. He's young. He likes to have fun. Um, along with a lot of the other guys we have, um, he's obviously a, a recognizable name. People have seen Fernando Tatis's name around before, um, but he just brings a lot of excitement. He's going to be a dynamic shortstop uh, at a young age, and I'm excited to see what his first season brings.